Hey everybody, um, I'm over here in Sweden, sorry for the radio silence. Again, just doing this um, more product photo shoots for Barions and more on life. Here with uh, Ida, say hey Ida. Hey. So while Ida was doing that, I decided to answer the call. It seems to be a, a thing on Instagram now and on, on Facebook to try and build these crazy tables. So I built this one here, which is a combination of the meat hammock that you see in On Living to Learn and the floating table built by DK Thomas outside with moss on it. There's about 15 kilos in my backpack, so I don't know if this will hold, but we'll try. But as you can see, I just use my quick deploy ridge line with the Prusik loops, a carabiner. You don't have to use a carabiner. Fisherman's knots for those micro adjustments. Again, I built this in about 20 minutes, so it's not perfect. You can see the fisherman's knots here. So just to bring it a bit of balance from there. And then if you look down in this direction, the Prusik loops allow you to... Whee! Lower it down over the fire or bring it back up. Perfect though. <laughs> <laughs> so I can imagine if you had a, I actually might use this myself as a bit of a smoke rack or a, a way to dry things or hang things over the fire. I mean, it's wasn't that complicated. And again, it's all dead wood. It could be perfected a bit more. I just use some jam knots and stuff, but if you're on a permanent camp, you could make it. So I think that's pretty cool. There you go, challenge shown down, meat hammock, floaty adjustable <laughs> table <laughs> take care everybody have a great week peace